Hi guys, um, I'm going to show you how to do basic keyword analysis. I'm going to use Keyword Snooper together with Google Keyword Planner. I'm going to do this tutorial very quickly. This is very basic keyword analysis. And I'm going to show you why this is important. Well, basically before you start any new website, uh, before you start um, a new YouTube project and whatever project you have in the works, it's advisable to do your keyword research. I'm going to use um, the key phrase cell phone covers. Well, there's an alternative spelling obviously, but I'm going to use this one here. Uh, just as an example, I have already run the project uh, in keyword snooper and I have already filtered the long tail keywords and I'm left at 401. Well, basically you can get maybe five, 600 depending on the sources that you use. And um, I have selected Google, Bing and Yahoo, I believe. So only three sources and I'm left with 401 long tail keywords and I have filtered them. So each one of them contains the word covers. So basically these are closely related to my main seed keyword. You can see I have used covers as filter and from here I'm going to export um, the keyword list as CSV file. I'm going to remove the special characters first and I'm going to save the file as CSV and from there I'm going to import it to Google Keyword Planner and I'm going to export back the new CSV file with the monthly average monthly searches and competition and so on. Well, I have already done that and uh, now we are going to open the Manage tab in Keyword Snooper and you can take a quick look at all the long tail keywords that we found. The first thing that you're going to notice is uh, the extremely high competition of all these keywords. And if you take a look at the average monthly searches, they are not that great either. I mean, the highest number here, it's 8,100 and the com competition is 0 0.99, which is extremely high. And then the second uh, keyword gets only 400 average monthly searches. Well, what these, um, num what these numbers tell you is that all these long tail keywords are very competitive and they're not likely to bring that much traffic. Well, you can obviously end your keyword analysis here, or you can uh, do something different. You can uh, try alternative keywords, uh, like maybe iPhone covers or cell phone covers, where cell phone is uh, spelled with uh, two different words, which is most likely the correct spelling. And you can also try whatever keyword comes to mind, and maybe you're going to find some um, long tail keywords that are not that competitive but um, I wouldn't use all these keywords that we found for my new website since uh, they're extremely competitive and the average monthly searches are very low